Welcome friends and students. In this video segment, we shall see how to add two octal numbers. When we talk about octal number, we know that the numbers range from 0 to 7. So there are 8 digits. So we only have numbers varying from 0 to 7. And what happens if the number becomes greater than 7? Say we have a number 8, 9, etc. So if the number is greater than 7, I have to divide the number by 8. So how do I represent 8? In octal, I divide it by 8. 1 is the quotient, 0 is the remainder. So 1, 0 is the octal representation of the decimal number. Right. So the decimal number 8 is represented as 1, 0 in octal. So the power of the units place is 8 power 0 and this is 8 power 1. So we have 1 into 8 power 1 plus 0 into 8 power 0 which gives me 8. Now suppose I have a number 15, decimal number 15. So how do I represent this in octal? So again I divide it by 8. So I get 1 as the quotient. And what is the remainder? The remainder is 7. So the decimal number 15 is nothing but 1, 7 in octal. Right? So what are the powers? So how do I convert this back to decimal? So it's going to be 1 into 8 power 1 plus 7 into 8 power 0. So this is 8 plus 7 into 1. Right? So this is 8 plus 7 which gives me 50. So this is important because if we add two octal numbers and if the number becomes greater than 7, then what happens? We have to convert it to octal format by dividing the given number by 8. So that is the reason why we have gone through this process. So let us take a few examples and let us see how we can add two octal numbers. Now the first example I have 232 plus 135. So remember these are octal numbers so the numbers will only vary from 0 to 7. So I need to add them. So 5 plus 2 is 7. The number is not greater than 7. So 3 plus 3 is 6 and 2 plus 1 is 3. So this is the added result and is an octal format. So we do not have to do anything because the added result is not greater than 7. So none of the digits in the added result are greater than 7. So let's take another example. I have 4, 5, 6 plus 5, 6, 7. So what do we do? So now 6 plus 7 is 13. So now this number 13 is greater than 7. So when the number is greater than 7, what should we do? We have to convert this in octal format because this is a decimal number, isn't it? So now I divide this by 8. I get 1 as the quotient and 5 as the remainder. So you write 5 and 1. So therefore, 13 in decimal is represented as 1, 5, right? So I write 5 and take the carry. So here I have 6 plus 5 plus 1 is 12. So again divide 12 by 8. I get 1 as the quotient and 4 as, as the remainder. So it is 1, 4. So decimal 12 is 1, 4 in octal. So I write 4 with a 1 carry. 5 plus 4 plus 1 is again 1, 0. 10 in decimal. So again divided by 8. I get 1, 2. So I get 1, 2. So this is the added result in octal. So it is 1, 2, 4, 5. So let's take another example. I have 2, 4, 6, 7. And then I have 7, 6, 5, 4. So these two are octal numbers. So you have numbers varying from 0 to 7 only. So again add them. So 7 plus 4 is 11. Which is of course greater than 7. I divide it by 8. I get the octal representation which is 1, 3. So 3 with a 1 carry. Next, 5 plus 6 plus 1 is 12. So I have 12 representation is 1, 4. Then I have 6 plus 4 plus 1 is 11 which is 1, 3. 3 with a 1 carry. And then I have 7 plus 2 plus 1 is 10. So 10 is nothing but 1, 2. Right? 1, 2. So this is the added result. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 
3 is the added result. So this is how we perform octal addition which is very simple. So you just have to remember that if the added result is greater than 7, you have to convert the digit to octal format and take the carry and perform addition as usual. Right? So we add two octal numbers in this way. So we have covered what happens when the added result is less than 7 or equal to 7. 7 and less than 7 you don't have to worry. If the added result is greater than 7 then this is what you need to do. Right? So in the next few video segments we will discuss how to perform octal subtraction and octal multiplication. So do not forget to like, share and subscribe and press the bell icon to get notifications of further uploads and thanks for watching.